Okay, Avenger bottle conversion uh, kit. First, you need a bottle. You can go on to AliExpress and get a uh, biggest bottle they got, which is this one. And it's only 18 bucks. But the shipping uh, add up to be like $35 to my door. Don't let it fool you. This sucker is heavy and it's thick. Versus the OME piece of crap, lightweight <coughs> bottle. See, if you look at my woody here, there are two, bo two bottles, one in there and one right there, okay? And you, you don't need any special tool to undo it. Right here. It's, I was surprised when I uh, uh, undo it. it. It's almost like finger tight, not even that. So basically you take the long one off and the short one off. The kit came with the plug, the plug up the top. And this guy here, go on the bottom. And this thread here, match it with this thread. Uh, I forgot what it is. Ah, uh, oh, damn it! I'll, I'll put it on a link. But basically, this is what you get. The conversion kit come with this right here, and the plug, and the a company in South Africa um, making them. Uh, I'll put a link uh, in the comment or. In the description but basically it's very simple I mean it's no brainer anybody can do this and only tool you gonna really need is this that's it it comes with o-rings and everything you just tie it up like so and then hit it. Don't have to be like, you know, gorilla tight. Just hit it. You know, pretty good. So it won't move, you know. That. And then the bottle came with a bunch of O rings. O rings. They give you extra O ring and screw on the bottle. Simple as that. It's nothing complicated about this uh, conversion. Okay. okay, this is what you got. And then you go over to uh, uh, 3D Air Gun Works and uh, get Miguel, Nuno Miguel, to print you out one of these uh, barrel band for your uh, tripod. I like to put it way down here for my tripod so it won't, you know, won't stretch out the bar too much. And then get Pablo, print you out a barrel support. And um, that way, this barrel is long, okay, it's long. Uh, and it, it, it's kind of flexed a little bit. So it, it does need it. Next. You want to print out this chassis. And um, that's the chassis. And then you can print out the grip. Everything can be found online under a tingless you can even print out the buffer tube and the butt stock which is I'm gonna show you over here so you go on there and you just see it right here it's free 
print it out on your uh, 3D printer and uh, look I got my first laptop and 3D printer a week ago I mean first time ever if I can do this you can do this and I'm 56 years old and uh, I thought it was complicated but it's not download a program onto your uh, computer and print it and then this is Let's see here. Hey, I'm still new with this. There you go. And then you get this uh this uh, program called Kira and you put it on there and you play with it. Um you know this thing here needs support so you go there and you just plug in the support. It's very simple. Like it's not as complicated as I thought it would be. So this is what you end up with the thing about this is it's free someone designed it, it's free okay so i have no complaint it's, 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 it can be improved and i will improve improve it i can remix it once i uh figure out how to use the the cat the cat the finger cat thing online the drawback is see right here that's your um, tension for your hammer spring. Um, on the Avenger, you can stick it. A screwdriver, not screwdriver. Uh, you know, one of these, one of these do that in there, and adjust it. Okay. With with uh, the 3D printed, you cannot. See right here, I put it on. See, it blocked it. You cannot. So, I was thinking, yeah, that sucks. But it dawned on me that I have an extra law tactical uh, AR uh, buffer tube folder. I can pour it. Get my thing in there and adjust it. Problem solved. Ah, a little bit stuck here. But the thing is, you gotta drill a hole. See, you gotta drill a hole, which is pretty pretty simple to do. Now, this law of technical is really expensive. I think it's 200 bucks, but you don't have to spend that money. You can go on AliExpress and buy similar one, like a knockoff or airsoft uh, for the AK for like less than 20 bucks. And this is just a um, string graph heat tube because the, uh, the, the plastic is slippery. So, and another thing is, uh, was my caliber. Let me put this back on. The one screw there, two, three, four. That's hold it on, okay? And you can use all the the screw that you took out from the Avenger. The thing is. This is meant for, you know, a traditional rifle, not for like a, a pistol grip. So if I put my thing on like that, and compare to, okay, keep in mind the Avenger is designed like that, a traditional rifle, not with a pistol grip. So if I put a caliber on here, see that? compared to my AR see the gap right there compared to my FX M3 see the gap right there so it's a little bit longer but it's not as bad as I thought it would be but compared to my crown maybe a quarter inch so keep that in mind got longer reach 
So I find out the best grip for this is similar to a penguin grip. Uh, the penguin lets you, lets you rest your thumb on the right side. Uh, the idea of this is uh, less control is better. What's it like that? Less control is better. And uh, in this grip, I print out perfectly for this gun. And one more thing that people ask is uh, the buffer tube thread. The tree printer did pretty damn good job. I was I was thinking may maybe I need to, to tap it, but no, I didn't have to. See right here. So that's nothing to be worried about. So the question is. Is the gun shoot better? Yes. Um, it's a lot more comfortable to shoot. And you can adjust the stock. And you can put in different type of grip. Um, the accuracy is always there. Um, it, 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 it did not change. But the killer thing is the bottle. Oh my god. You, you, can, you can double easily to triple your, uh, your shoot count. Which is a tiny, too tiny bottle. And when you remove the small and the long bottle, save it. And you can put it into your ball pop. See? The ball pop. See right there? It's this piece right here. It's almost like it's designed for you to take it out and install a longer one. So they, again, all you need is a screwdriver with a fill head. Take it out, undo the little bottle, put in the big bottle that came from, you know, the takeoff for this gun. Uh, if I happen to be able to get another one, I'm going to convert that one too. It, it's just nice to shoot. It looks cool. So, um, that's it. Thanks for watching.